guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're well i hope you're having a lovely week happy sunday he's excited for the haul i did a huge order on i saw it first and got some really lovely pieces i was thinking autumn basics and just some stuff that my wardrobe needed but got some really good bits i haven't tried anything on other than one hoodie but you guys really loved the last um i saw it first haul that i did last year and i did it part of Jodie tried and tested and we all were impressed so I thought I would go back on and see what they deliver in this season. So if you want to see what I picked up from I saw it first then please keep watching. So the first thing that I got I actually wore to the cinema last night. It's such a cute slogan white hoodie. How cute is that? I got it in a medium but the size guide was a little bit weird. It was like if you get a medium, if you choose medium you'll get large. So I picked medium because I thought if I pick large then I'm going to get over like oversized and a large it would be too big so this is what it says it says baby girl in blue i'm obsessed with cobalt blue at the moment and i think the pink on it is really nice it says new order on i don't really know what that all means but it looks really cool i just wore it with black leggings and balenciaga sock trainers and it looked really cool so the next thing that i got i've been wanting like a nice white t-shirt dress i got one from nasty girl last year but i've lost it somehow so i picked this one up and it's actually like white ribbed i don't know if the, it's just like white ribbed like that i don't know if this is going to be big enough i got it in a 10 because i didn't want it to be too big but i don't know i'm interested to see how this fits because i sort of wanted the sleeves to be really baggy but they sort of just look fitted so i don't know about that but i was thinking this with like a gilet and some big chunky boots would look really cool for autumn so we'll see how it looks but i'm not sure the next thing that i picked up was another big white hoodie i haven't got any white hoodies i've only got sweatshirts and i really wanted one i feel like they're really useful for like layering so i picked this one up i got this one in a medium i think i'll put my sizes in the description but this one is a lot bigger than the baby girl one it's literally huge But it feels really thick it's fleecy which i like it's not super thick so i don't think it's going to be really warm but i just thought a staple and it was really affordable so now we've got a skims dupe this is probably going to be a rubbish dupe but i saw this on the site and i thought it was really cute it's this little like borg um like beigey brownie sort of borg crop top and then it's got matching joggers but it does just feel really thin but i think like maybe with a leather jacket over the top or a big black bomber just like for a comfy like sunday look then this would be really cute the joggers have actually got pockets and a proper drawstring so you could cinch this waist in and it could look cute maybe with just some slides or slippers even as pajamas but I was thinking nice for this sort of time of year. Okay, you guys are ready for this. These are some really bright green split hem leggings, but they're like knitted and they're literally the thickest material ever. I'm just hoping that they look really nice because they sort of go like that at the top, which worries me a little bit, but maybe it's just because they're stretchy. But my vision for these was black little crop black leather jacket black um boots and like for like a shopping day i'm thinking or with even just like a big oversized sweater over the top i love split hem leggings and i'm just obsessed with green at the moment it's so weird and the quality of these is insane like this is like zara quality not i saw it first i don't know how they've got their hands on this material i got these in a size a I just think they're gorgeous i feel like they're very me and i think it's nice to have a pop of color with um trousers in autumn staying true to the green trend i picked up this oversized blazer i got this in a size a which i don't think i ordered it in an eight i think i ordered it in a 10 but it's an eight it's this really nice like emeraldy green colour but it just doesn't look very big it is double breasted it is very smart so maybe like for a work vibe or a six form over a little dress this would be perfect but for what i wanted it for i feel like it's not really big enough i was thinking like over a black unitard like really oversized or over like black leggings hoodie but i just don't think it's big enough for it but 
it is really cute and i think it was really affordable i think that's what's good about oh, i saw it first they've got the really cool colors but at affordable price point you don't always want to invest like 50 pounds into a green blazer which you're not going to wear every day okay i saw these on the site and i had to pick them up just because i was really curious about how they would look on me they're like a black cargo pan they're just like wide leg they're the typical like cargo -y sort of material they haven't got any pockets um, going down the leg but they have got little pockets here they've got a drawstring elasticated waist so I'm thinking oh no it's a fake one okay well I got these in a size 8 so hopefully they cinch me in at the waist anyway but I just thought these would be really cool with like Jordan's little crop top leather jacket bomber I haven't got a black pair of cargo pants I've only got nude from PLT so I thought these would be a lovely addition if they look nice sorry I have a bit of a cold I think um but I think these will be really cool, even with like crop sweaters. I feel like they're just a bit of a classic for the wardrobe. And instead of me always reaching for jeans and leggings and joggers, I feel like it's nice to have a little bit of a switch off with the trousers. So we'll see. That's a bit of a different thing for me. Okay, I saw this top and I had to get it. It's like a really nice thinly knitted half crop black top i don't have like a cropped zip top and i love them i think they're really flattering and it just reminds me of chintzia back in the day like 2017 2018 whenever she was bobbed wearing balenciagas every day this is all chintzia i've used to wear and she looked so cool and i think they're just really flattering because you can have the zip all the way up you can pull the zip down and have it a little bit more a um, little bit more skin on show but i just think these are lovely paired with um joggers with jeans under a blazer just think it's a nice staple and i'm thinking going into like autumn winter the long sleeve version of these tops are going to come in useful again for layering also paired with the cargo pants that could be really cute okay and then the last thing i have to leave this till last because i'm so excited about it i picked up this khaki trench now if you've watched me for a while i picked up a leather nude trench from Miss Pap last year, last September I think it was, in the Tia Limited collection and I still wear it, I wore it yesterday, I absolutely love it. I really love trenches again for layering like under hoodies, I just think they make an ape, it looks so cool and put together and I saw this khaki green one and I'd actually watched Sophie and Chintzia's Paris vlog on Friday night and all they were wearing was trenches and when I saw this I was like I'm gonna have to order it it's got like a lot of extra detail which I love you've got like brownie grey nude um turtle shell buttons and you've got like these little what are these called it's not lapel is it it's like little straps on the shoulder and you've got a lovely collar you've got buttons all the way down with a nice belt so you can tie it you can have it loose the only thing which is making me feel a bit icky about it is the sleeves being like this i don't know how i feel about that like i've never really seen that on a trench like but then I'm, i suppose i could just like go like that I don't know, that's the only thing that I'm not 100% but my vision for this is all black, through over anything, through over tracksuits, through over like hoodies with leggings and um, I also love trenches over like long um, sleeved unitards, I think it looks really cool but I just love it, it's a real classic like trench material and this was only £35, I got this in a size... 10 um i didn't want it to be too big because i feel like they do come quite oversized anyway trenches and it's also got like slit at the back i'll show you better on the try and clip but i just think it's really cool really timeless piece and i thought for 35 pound like what a bargain something that i know i'll keep in my wardrobe forever because trenches never go out of fashion so i just thought a nice khaki color like khaki olive was a nice um change for my nude trench and that is everything that i've picked up from i saw it first this week their website to be honest is really good they have a lot of nice pieces but i just really wanted to stay like basic and sort of build up the basics in my wardrobe rather than splurging on marble print bodysuits and things that i'm only going to wear a few times so i think i've done my aim with this haul i've got a lot of good autumn basics which i feel like are really versatile as well you can wear so many different ways 
in the try on clips I would have styled them classically how I would style them today so I hope you guys all really enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe my birthday wish is to hit a thousand subscribers we are 12 off today so hopefully by Thursday we will have hit a thousand so if you haven't subscribed please make sure that you do and I will see you guys on Thursday I vlogged yesterday I vlogged a little day in my life getting my shit back together so stay tuned for that and then Sunday will be my birthday vlog I will leave the links to all of these pieces in the description box below and I'll put my sizes because I know a lot of the pieces don't have their sizes in and I always asterisk my favorite pieces once I've tried them on so check the description box out for that because I'll give you a more well-rounded review of the pieces so I hope you guys have a lovely week and I'll see you on Thursday bye guys